Hey guys, what is going on? Thanks for stopping by to watch another episode here at All I See Is W, where we talk about stocks, potential investments to gain on positive proceeds and to lead with an altruistic mindset. Now, if you're new to this channel, I'd really appreciate you hitting the like and subscribing for more related content. Today, I'll be sharing with you one stock that I believe has the potential for huge return on investment. I'll share with you why I believe this company has so much upside potential, what the future price target is for the year 2023, and overall just giving you updates on what's really driving the price up. Let's begin. Now we're looking at Mullen Automotive. This ticker goes by MULN. As of today, as you can see, the stock price had gone up by about 12% in total, right? What's driving the, the price up? Well, there was recent news about a partnership where Mullen will be working with Menzies Aviation Pilot to expand and get into electric vehicles. We'll talk more about that and go through the source articles, but just looking at technicals and fundamentals here, right? I mean, volume has been picking up with this company and what we've noticed is if we zoom out here right just with the mon one month trajectory it's gone up by about 19 percent here at one point it was at the low peak of like 18 cents you know like looking at december time frame however when it got down to the 18 19 cents it started building a base there so i really do think this is the basement low at 18 19 cents and where we currently are it's consolidating and if we zoom out why i think this is such a great opportunity is that when you look at it from a zoomed out perspective buying in at this price at this time it's it's at the basement low you're getting it at a discount and what goes down from a one year perspective will eventually go up right i i don't foresee this type of company, especially with EV doing so well at this time, we can see that with Tesla, with Lucid, right? Mullen has the potential to make a huge run and I really do think this is a great opportunity to see Mullen start taking off, right? I mean, all it takes is just more information coming out, right? And people are saying that, oh, Mullen is a meme stock, you know, there there's just risk with Mullen, it's not going to go up, right? I easily see Mullen in February breaking the 50 cents range, and once we see that happening, right, there's potential for it to continue to climb up and then just climb up the stair ladder and get back to its prior resistance values. We go back here, looking at a, a, a five-year trend chart here, at one point, back in 2020 this was hovering at $15 right and it's just been bleeding out I mean it dropped down to $7 back in 2021 October and then it shot up to $12.95 and now it's down at the 38 cents why do I like this just based on fundamentals based on just keeping it simple investing buying low and selling high is going to have you win in this market so for that reason i definitely think that it's a great buying opportunity uh for for mullen even though we saw it at uh 18 19 cents 38 cents to me is still a great opportunity and it's rallied for uh for like 20 percent gains in the month of january already which is a uh, great news now just specifically what drove the company's uh, share price up with the increased volume right well this American automotive electric vehicle manufacturer based out in Southern California. I mean, they actually partnered up with another company, Menzies, right? Menzies is the world's largest airport services company. They actually have operating airports around 58 countries with a total of 250 locations, right? And its fleet has about 8,000 vehicles, and they're planning on upgrading those vehicles to go EV. So what does that mean with Mullen? Mullen's going to have to increase its throughput to provide these electric vehicles. And what's unique about working with Menzies is that Menzies already has like EV ports all around the United States already. So it's, it's just like 
you know, with charge point, if you think about it. So this is huge. I mean, collaborating with suppliers, airports, and our airline customers is vital for Menzies to achieve its sustainability goals. So this is huge. And when you think about it, this is specific to the LAX airport in Southern California. We know there's just lots of foot traffic movement there. So I really see that this is positive news. Now, just looking at another source data here, right? I mean, Mullen, as what I've mentioned, it's a Southern California automotive company, right? And it has uh, manufacturers uh, specifically uh, in two US-based uh, assembly plants. Now, the company has the Mullen 5 EV crossover in the Mullen Igo commercial urban delivery, a Mullen commercial class 1-3 EVs and Bollinger's uh, Motors which features both the B1 and B2 electric uh, SUV trucks and class four to six commercial offerings. So as you can see, a wide range of various uh, vehicles here, and it's definitely a competitor not to ignore, right? I know that, you know, there's other high-end companies like, you know, Tesla, Lucid, where the focus is to tap more into the luxury side where we're you know the audience has a propensity to buy those vehicles this taps more into the uh the the different population of, of people and now partnering up with a a center that focuses on just you know travel uh within the airline industry that's just huge uh, overall in terms of price forecasting i see that Mullen has a potential to break $2, uh, whether that's in the first half of the year, second half of the year. I'd say $2 is at a minimum. We can easily see this run up to like uh, $5 uh, um, very soon. I mean, just with news release. So that's my overall perspective. I hope that this video added value. If you're new to, to Mullen, I would you know continue to, to monitor this company let's say if you're a long-term investor if you bought in at the higher price i'd say just be patiently aggressive uh if if you you know let's say bought in at a higher price i would consider dollar cost averaging down but just just with evs doing so well right now in the market sector i would really uh look into mullen automotive as a potential buy opportunity but just being mindful that there's always going to be risk associated with investing so just know what your risk tolerance and profile is and apply it to your investment strategy so thanks for watching i hope that you enjoyed this video please make sure to hit the like and add comments down below as well as any questions thank you